drawing from the insights of Guy Debord, Michel Foucault and Félix Guattari, and their seminal works like Society of the Spectacle, Discipline and Punish, Madness and Civilization, Anti-Oedipus, and A Thousand Plateaus, we can offer a reframed perspective on the convergence of dystopian cultural modes, geopolitical conflicts, mass media manipulation, and oppression. In the spectacle-driven dystopian society depicted by Guy Debord, the metaphysics of Moronism find expression through the relentless commodification of knowledge and the relentless pursuit of superficial entertainment. Here, the spectacle serves as both a tool of distraction and a means of social control, perpetuating a culture of passive consumption and superficiality that discourages critical thought and dissent. Michel Foucault's analysis of discipline and power dynamics sheds light on how oppressive regimes in dystopian societies employ mechanisms of surveillance, punishment, and normalization to maintain control over the populace. In such societies, institutions of power, such as the state and the mass media, impose disciplinary regimes that regulate behavior, suppress dissent, and reinforce conformity. Individuals who deviate from the norm are subjected to disciplinary measures aimed at enforcing compliance and reinforcing the dominant ideology. Meanwhile, Felix Guattari's concepts of schizoanalysis and Chow Sophie offer a framework for understanding the complexities of subjectivity and desire in dystopian societies. In the face of oppressive power structures and repressive social norms, individuals may experience various forms of psychic and social repression, leading to alienation, fragmentation, and internalized self-oppression. Kuwaitari's notion of deterritorialization highlights the potential for resistance and subversion within these systems, as individuals and communities seek to disrupt the rigid hierarchies and binary divisions that underpin the status quo. Overall, the convergence of these theoretical perspectives offers a nuanced understanding of the dynamics at play in dystopian societies where the metaphysics of Moronism intersect with mechanisms of power, control, and resistance. By interrogating the interplay between spectacle, discipline, desire, and madness, we can gain insight into the complexities of oppression and liberation in an increasingly dystopian world shaped by geopolitical conflicts, mass media manipulation, and pervasive systems of social control.